Hey there, folks. It's uh, December 17th, and it's about right now 11:30 p.m. Uh, I started out from the clubhouse tonight at around 8:30 or so. Uh, my goal tonight was to have E108 in a limited condition for uh, tomorrow. That'd be December 18th. Um, since we have our trail reports due tomorrow morning, so we'd like to be able to report on the OFSC site that D108 East from the clubhouse over to Long Sioux would now be in limited condition. So basically what's been happening tonight is we got probably about an inch of fresh snow. Um, saw some light traffic on the trails, uh, mostly just some locals. And the base that we set up on the 12th of December uh, seems to have worked pretty well. Um, looks like we had a little bit of truck traffic, so it was uh, running up just a bit. But we've been able to cut that out tonight. And uh, there looks to be about four inches of frozen base under the fresh snow that we got. And it's all coming out pretty flat. So tomorrow morning we will be able to open E-108 East from the clubhouse. It's a limited condition. Uh, with limited condition trails, make sure that uh, use caution at all times. Um, in spots, there's not quite enough snow to cover uh, the odd rock, maybe some deeper ruts that were left from the summer. Um, so you don't want to be flying through the trails and come up on that unexpectedly, so use caution at all times. <clears throat> Everything north of the clubhouse is obviously closed. Lake Cougar is still unsafe, and everything in the north end is still closed because some of our landowners aren't quite ready to open the trails for us, and we don't quite have enough snow up there to cover the winter crops. So again, this is December 17th. Uh, we'll be opening E-108 to limited condition east from the clubhouse over to Long Sioux, which means we'll be able to get all the way to the Anaraska Forest. Here's a look at uh, 